Hello, how are you? I'm Pete and this is one of the drinks that featured in episode 59 of our Cocktail Collective live series. Uh, it's a bit, of a, a bit of a divider, this one, if I'm honest. Personally, I think it's really good. Um, loads of flavour going on. Um, but yeah, it was a bit of a marmite, really. So yeah, if you do try it, if you do make it at home, let us know. Did you like it or didn't you? Let's have a see. Uh, but it's pretty simple. It is pretty simple, but again, the flavours that come out of this are just awesome. You're going to need a very cold coupette or martini glass or cocktail glass. This one's fresh out of the freezer, uh, so I need to get a bit of a wriggle on. And I've already got ice in my shaker as well, so we are good to go. Are you joining in? Are we in? Okay, let's do it. Let's start then with 50 millilitres, five zero millilitres of our Black Tears Dry Spiced Cuban Rum. The only... Spiced rum from Cuba. We're then going to go, this, is, uh, this was the divider, uh, with 20 millilitres of Jaeger. Jaegermeister, not for everyone. But when used correctly, 20 ml. So we've got coffee and chocolate and the sweet chilli pepper in here. Got loads of herbs and roots and fruits in here. Uh, you could obviously, you, it's just a bit of liqueur. Uh, if you want to switch it out for other things, whichever you prefer, then try it and let us know what you do. Uh, pimento dram, things like that work really well. Uh, we're then going to use some falernum. This adds a really nice sweetener, but this particular falernum is really sort of fruity and herbaceous at the same time, um, but still being sweet. Um, so yeah, it reminds me a little bit like Christmas cake um, by itself. Um, we're then going to go with a couple of squirts of our aromatic bitters. So probably, there we go, just to again enhance the herbal um, liqueur uh, from the Jaeger, the herbal notes from the Jaeger and also the, uh, the chocolate and the coffee from our rum. 25 ml of pineapple juice. We're going to shake this really hard and then we're going to go, I've got a quarter of an orange just give that a good squeeze. Quarter of an orange. There we go. Don't worry about it if you get any bits of uh, fruit in there. It's all good. Um, it will all be used at some point and we'll strain it out anyway. So it's all fine. Okay, that's it. We are set to go. Again, we need to get a bit of a wriggle on because my glass is starting to defrost. Make sure that everything's on and sealed. Three, two, one, and check. Good hard shake, we've got the pineapple juice in there, don't forget. And also because we've used proper fresh orange, it will also whip up really nicely. So to put some effort in, we're looking for good dilution. And are you ready? We're going to call it in three, two, one. There we go. Look at that, brilliant chill on there. We know that that is going to be super super cold so much so that we can't get the lid off oh well have a look he says oh here we go oh dear i hope you uh if you're doing this at home you're a bit more successful than i am here we go we've got it in the end mm. smell everything as well in this drink it works so good everything just layers brilliantly uh, flavor profile wise we are fine straining this, double strain. Get some height on it. Oops, not too much. There we go. And then because we've put some effort in, because we've got the pineapple juice and because we've got the, the fresh orange juice as well, you get a really nice frothy foam on the top, gives it a really nice velvet, uh, luxurious sort of feel to it. Um, and then we're going to garnish that with, it's up to you really, I'm going to go with just an orange wheel right in the centre of the drink. Um, you can use lime, lemon, whatever fruit you prefer, but because I've used orange, I'm going to accompany that with an orange slice as well. Mmm. Perfect for a day like this when the sun is shining and I hope it is where you are. So yeah, thank you very much. This has been uh, one of the drinks featured on episode 59 of our Cocktail Cuts of Life. Have a look around. There's loads of other videos. 
showcasing lots of drinks that were made. Uh, so yeah, thanks very much. See you again soon. Bye.